Hi viewers, I am Raji Ramkrishnan. I am going to make Mysore Pak here. For making Mysore Pak, I have taken half cup of basin, that is gram flow. You have to sieve it and uh, use it. Now, two cups of uh, sugar. You can uh, use one and a half cup also. And basically, one is to two is to three is the proportion for the Mysore Pak, that is. Uh, one uh, cup of uh, basin, two cups of sugar, and three cups of ghee. These are the three items required for making Mysore Pak. But due to health conscious, I have reduced all the quantity like uh, ghee and uh, sugar, I have reduced to one and a half and uh, two. So, one for a half cup of um, basin, I have taken. I have measured with this only one and a half cup sugar and uh, two cups of ghee. Now we have to melt the sugar with little water and uh, I will add little ghee in this and mix and keep it well so that while adding the basin into the sugar syrup it, you will not uh, get the lumps in it. You will be able to smoothly uh, mix it well. Now let us put some water in this and uh, make the syrup. I have added water just above the sugar level. Uh, normally what, how I make the Mysore Pak is after melting the sugar I used to add the basin ghee mix in it. Now today I am going to make one string of this um, sugar syrup that is my mother-in-law's method. So now I will pour a little ghee in this and mix and well. Now in this basin I have mixed one and a half cup ghee. Again I remind you with the cup which you are measuring the basin you have to take the same cup for measuring the sugar and the ghee. You see without forming lump I have already mixed and kept it here. One part sugar syrup is ready. I have mixed the basin and the ghee in it. After adding the basin ghee mix in it, you have to keep on stirring it. Else it will stick to the bottom and uh, it will get burnt. So you should keep on stirring it. In case if you find any lumps in it, you can just press it with the back of the spatula. And don't cook the same on the high flame. Keep the flame medium to low, low to medium. And if you are a beginner, always use less quantity to make the same because I learned this by spoiling a lot of uh, ghee and sugar and basin because it never used to come out very nicely. Several times I tried, tried, tried and I 
finally succeeded in making this Mysore Pak. So you have to be little careful. So always make little quantity. Whenever you try any recipe, for that matter, always try in little quantity. Now she started leaving the sides of the kadai. It's almost done. Now it's time for us to pour some more ghee in it, the remaining ghee when the quarter cup of ghee is uh, required to be poured in this, into this. <laughs> Here I have raised the chiffin box for getting uh, square pieces. So I don't have a square tray, I have a round tray. So I prefer this since I am making little quantity only. I thought I will put it in the chiffin box. Now I have already made and kept here. Last week I made because my daughter wants to have this mesu pakka. So for her, you know, I use little less ghee because she doesn't uh, ghee like ghee much in the Mysore Pak. She wants slightly the harder side of the Mysore Pak. So, now see she has started leaving the sides of the kadai. You need to Final stage you need two persons to shoot the video because I am doing it all alone. While pouring it, somebody there should be there to shoot the video. Once it is almost done. Just started leaving the sides of the kadai very well. At this stage, you have to reduce the flame. And cook in very low heat. Now see how it is. forming into a lump now. If you do not pour this into the plate at the appropriate time, then what will happen is it will become like this. It will become a powdery consistency. Now see, it is the time to pour. I, I hope I have it. I am able to cover this. I don't know whether it is.
and with them with the ghee spoon just press it down and smooth on the surface allow this to cool for 10 minutes then you can cut it it has come out very nicely see this portion i could not put it in this because i told you you need two people in the final stage you need two people and this no problem you can just uh, remove it from the kadai why i am showing this is the beginners should not get puzzled that's why i'm showing this and you can just remove this and eat it as it is in the powdery form there's no problem now it's time for to cut this dip the knife in the ghee cut into pieces also now let this cool completely before taking it out we will invert this into a plate to remove the pieces i have removed all the pieces from the tiffin box now i see that my soup is ready here to serve thank you so much for watching the video subscribe to my channel like share and comment 